For his latest trial, pro-democracy activist Jimmy Lai wasn't authorized to face news cameras. He was brought in directly from jail in a van. The businessman who owns Hong Kong's most influential pro-democracy newspaper, Apple Daily, and nine other defendants pleaded guilty of taking part in what Chinese law calls an unauthorized assembly, otherwise known as a pro-democracy protest. This is the right and freedom guaranteed to us under the basic law, under the Bill of Rights, and under the International Covenant for civil and political rights. China tightened its grip on Hong Kong after weeks of protests and clashes in 2019. Activists then protested against a bill that would have allowed to extradite Hong Kong residents to mainland China to be tried. That bill was shelved, but then China passed a new national security law, which has led to the arrest of hundreds of pro-democracy activists. But the whole world is watching and people are very concerned. We are very, very sad and very alarmed. Last week, China froze Jimmy Lai's assets, putting his media group Next Digital at risk. As Lai stood in court, the Hong Kong Stock Exchange halted the trading of his company's shares.